I'm Ebony North for Investment Pitch Media. Stratabound Minerals Corp. reported multiple new high-priority anomalies derived from soil sampling programs at its Golden Culvert property during its 2021 field season. The Golden Culvert project is located approximately 20 kilometers northeast of Seabridge Gold's Three Aces and Aben Resources' Justin High-Grade Gold projects in the southeast Yukon Territory. The company completed first-pass reconnaissance soil sampling across 17.5 kilometers of strike in the previously unexplored northern portion of the property. Three new superior gold in soil anomalies were defined, averaging 1.2 kilometers of strike and greater than 15 meters in width, yielding gold values consistently between 20 parts per billion and 1,050 parts per billion gold. The new discoveries demonstrate a strong periodicity occurring at approximate 2 kilometer intervals along 14 kilometers of strike north of and including the Golden Culvert Main Discovery Zone. Numerous additional smaller and discontinuous anomalies between 20 parts per billion and 190 parts per billion gold were also identified along a corridor along strikes of previously identified gold mineralized trends. The new anomalies compare well with the original Golden Culvert main discovery anomaly. 7.5 kilometers of strike in the southern portion of the property remains virtually untested. Some of the gaps in mineralization occur in glacial valleys, where alpine glaciation has transported barren till and covered the underlying surface. During 2021, a total of 1,027 samples were collected across a grid of 29 lines, with a 200-meter line spacing and 50-meter sample spacing per line on the Little Highland North Claim Group, and 547 samples across a grid of 16 lines, with a 400-meter spacing and 50-meter sample intervals per line were collected on the Rubus Claim Group. To date, a total of 5,742 soil samples have been collected on the property. Of this total, 227 samples, or 4%, that make up the anomalies averaged 134.1 parts per billion gold, ranging between 20 to 9,040 parts per billion gold, and most notably occur above a background average of 2.2 parts per billion gold. Though the company cautions that similar expectations may not be met, the Golden Culvert main zone has yielded diamond drill results of up to 2.53 grams per ton gold, over 33.1 meters, including 60.1 grams per ton gold over 0.9 meters. Trench values up to 95 grams per ton gold over 1.5 meters, and surface float train samples yielding up to 320 grams per ton gold, within the 3 kilometer by 250 meter wide gold in soil anomaly were also previously reported at the original Golden Culvert discovery. These are similar to those surrounding Seabridge's gold nearby high grade 3 Aces gold project, which featured a 5,401 grams per ton gold surface sample discovered in 2003. R. Kim Tyler, President and CEO, stated, We are pleased and quite encouraged by these new discoveries. Where we previously had only one high gold value anomaly defining the Golden Culvert main discovery and a few lesser gold targets, we now have five high priority as well as many more smaller, less continuous targets for follow-up exploration work. With a successful campaign completed in the northern 70% of the property, we also look forward to exploring the remaining open-ended 30% to the south. The company's flagship Fremont Gold Project lies within California's prolific Motherlow Gold Belt, one of the most prolific gold belts in the world, which was estimated to have produced 50 million ounces of gold throughout history. In New Brunswick, the company has the McIntyre Brook Project, an exciting new iron oxide, copper gold exploration project, and three base metal deposits in the Bathurst Base Metals Camp including the Captain Copper Cobalt Gold Deposit that hosts an NI43101 measured and indicated resource. The shares are trading at 10 cents. For more information, please visit the company's website at stratabound.ca. Contact R. Kim Tyler, President and CEO, at 416-915-4157 or email info at stratabound.com. I'm Ebony North for Investment Pitch Media.